Hey everybody and welcome to my channel. I'm doing a spread for you today for a cross watcher. So if your ex is a sun, moon, rising, or Venus oops, um, Capricorn, then this, whoa, this reading is for you. I ask that you just put a comment down in the comment box below. Um, letting me know if you would like me to continue it or not and uh, make sure you like it as well because that's how I determine what order my readings get released in for the next set of readings. So we'll go ahead and get started because the cards are flying out. Let's see what we got. Your ex Capricorn. Okay. One card for each row, two clarified. And I will clarify the major arcana. Why is the wheel of fortune here? Only one major arcana? Not much change going on in the Capricorn's uh, life and another major account. I'm going to get another one. Why is the sun clarifying the Wheel of Fortune? Okay. I'm going to go ahead and clarify the court cards since you guys don't have many major arcana. So your Capricorns, um, they have the King of Cups clarified by the King of Pentacles. So um, they have still a very intense love for you. Um, they're working on their stability. They're working on their finances. Um, so that way they have something to offer when they come back towards you. You could have been the one that left this Capricorn as well. Because they um, feel that you were their happiness, their joy, their solid foundation. Could have had a home together, um, possibly children. Um, and that's why they're refusing to move on. Refusing to move forward um, and giving up on this connection. Uh, they have a choice between um, a couple people with the two of wands here in reverse. They're at a crossroads, but they're, they're holding strong. They're still holding out for this connection. Um, and I'm not going to lie, this is a, a beautiful connection between the two of you. Um, there could be children involved, but uh, they are waiting to give you an offer, to make an offer towards you, to ask you to come back. Um, with the Wheel of Fortune here in the upright, clarified by the sun with the Knight of Pentacles, I'm going to tell you um, this is a soulmate uh, connection. You two will come back together. Um, it will take a little bit of time. But the sun is here guiding it and karma is on your side. Um, yeah, most definitely. Um, there's just some balance that needs uh, brought back to uh, the center scales. They, they could have been, um, there could have been a third party. Uh, you could be the third party waiting for them to leave uh, somebody else. But however, they were splitting their energy. Um, it could have been between you and work as well. You know, it doesn't have to be two people. It could, it's just two things in life that were distracting them and, and uh, making them uh, divide up their energy. The overall um, energy of this row is the Ten of Swords, however. So um, there was some there was some betrayal behind the back. There was something going on, and you guys know about this, obviously, your exes. But, um, but that came to light. This, however, is uh, 
is a twin flame, is a soulmate. As you see, they refuse to move on because they know that this is the Ten of Cups for them. Uh, they have the Eight of Cups here, and um, they feel you complete their Two of Cups. So they are trying to remain strong. They're trying to uh, remain uh, confident and hopeful and have faith in this connection uh, that they can hold out and that you will return. Uh, the Ten of Cups is in reverse, however, they are um, they are feeling drained from this, from waiting on this, from dealing with somebody else in the energy, um, but judgment is here with the Karma card, and it's in the upright, so this Ten of Cups is going to come back up into the upright once the Wheel of Fortune turns and the Sun guides the spiritual journey in that direction. This is a um, relationship coming back together with the karma card and the 10 of cups. Um, your ex Capricorn is, um, they're, they're moving on, um, with their emotional pain. They spent a lot of sleepless nights. They spent a lot of tears wondering why you left and went back to this ex that you had, um, because they thought you were their four of wands. You thought they, they thought you were their 10 of cups their two of cups. Um, but they are healing. They are slowly healing. They're getting to a point where they're okay whether you come back or not. Um, and it's being clarified by the Knight of Cups. So you are coming. It is just a delay or them to you. There is a delay for some reason. I'm going to grab one for the whoa, Major Arcana that came out. Karma, yeah, Page of Wands. Yeah, they're waiting to hear from you. And King of Wands, beautiful. Oh my goodness. And fool came out on the bottom. Yeah, this is definitely um, going to come back into a uh, commitment, a four of wands, twin flame, soulmate, marriage, connection, whatever you want to call it. Um, this Capricorn just has to set out on their spiritual journey. Um, they have to heal. They have to do the work. They're hoping to not have to do any work and you're just going to come back. Um, and that's unfortunately not how it works because uh, we're it's made to it's meant to separate us so um, we can heal and be the best version of ourselves we can be so when we come back into union we can give that much more to the collective the card that just popped out was chemistry so there's obviously a strong ma magnetic uh, connection here you guys feel drawn to each other. Um, you could be um, still seeing each other every once in a while as well, like on the low, low with this Capricorn. Um, yep, very soon just popped. Very soon. Make it very clear to the universe and to yourself and to everyone or uh, to your higher power to uh, clearly decide what it is that you want because you are going to manifest this back together or your Capricorn is going to to you. Um, they just need to start putting in the work because, I mean, the soulmate card is here. The Ten of Cups is here. The Four of Wands is here. The Sun is here. The Wheel of Fortune is here. And the Judgment card. I mean, how and Strength. How many more cards do, do we need to, to point us in this direction? This is definitely a Twin Flame soulmate connection if that's the journey you're on. If you are just... Um, in a uh, uh, life partner connection, whatever kind of connection this is, this will last. This is um, someone you will be with the rest of your life. So um, take the time to do the work if that's you. Otherwise, um, Capricorn, they will start doing the work. Uh, we're in this energy shift right now where it's kind of like shift or be shifted. I said that in some other reading too, but um, Capricorn's been kind of holding back on doing putting in the work, but the universe is about to uh, shift in their favor and push them into uh, walking that spiritual path when they become more consciously aware of this connection. So it's a beautiful connection, guys. If you are waiting on a Capricorn or are in separation from a Capricorn, I do see reconciliation very, very soon. So keep working hard and keep the faith. As always, I send you love, light, and God bless.